morning everybody so today we are going to work on cars uh, it's very cold but it's not winter yet it is kind of winter yet it's end of the month um, I would say it's winter but anyways I want to work on my cars as early as possible this year last year we did last minute like normal but I want to try to get ahead this year so we're gonna start working on what we can do uh, so we're gonna work on a couple things and then I'm gonna show you how the progress today. Alright, so I finished loading the stuff so I'm going to head down to my walk and then I am going to see my friend later on today. I'm going to show you the progress. I'm going to eat something a little quick on lunch break and then uh, we're going to start working on the project in a little bit. This guy, how this transmission wheel? Tell me. Nice. <laughs> nice. You're going to oh, get one? Save, yeah, if I was rich like you. <laughs> so you're going to get one next year? Yeah, if you buy one for me for Christmas. Yeah, okay. Are what are you buying? Me? What the oh, fuck? Are you my secret Santa? Can I see it now? Yeah, I can buy this for 50 bucks, yeah. I will. Wow, this is nice though. Fucking brand new. Lots of bolts. Oh my god. Gasket. What is that oh, for? Like fucking Nissan bolts. It better be better, right? Island bearing, bell housing. Alright. So is this like external or internal slave? I don't know. That's the shifter, right? Shifter plate, I guess. Here you go, Yuki. You can put this on the. Where's the shifter? Oh, this is a shifter. Some stick stickers. Wow, these are sick. <laughs> put these on the Tacoma, Yuki? Yeah, okay. You gotta, yeah? Where's it at? That's the shifter, right? Yep. Brakes. Yeah? If you're swapping to S16, you need the oh, bell yeah. housing That's bulkhead. That's a nice paint job, like <laughs> <laughs> Tools needed. Sawzall with 12-inch blade. Cut-off grinder. All right. Do we have a sawzall with 12-inch blade? I don't know about 12-inch blade, but... Let's figure it out. Yeah. Draw a line quarter-inch behind... <laughs> That's a good ...the one. rib that goes around the transmission. I can't even lead that. <laughs> There's fucking like three ribs on it. It's the first rib. Right behind this, right here. You wanna watch a video first? No, yeah, just, just make sure don't, cause we gotta cut this Breathing. new one. Kinda worry about that. <laughs> That's so scary. Really like this. Cutting a brand new thing off. Can you measure the quarter inch on it? So we gotta cut this housing down. That sucks. Wait, are you gonna buy this one for me? This housing? Yeah. Th thousand bucks. <laughs> Dude, that's a good deal. All right. Oh, we gotta. All right, so mark. we're gonna cut this guy. Mark and cut three eighths inch off the input shaft. Chamfer the end. The shaft somewhere to the OEM. Put that thing on, will you? Oh, what are you doing? Uh, just putting a brace on. You do it. Easy part. This is a sketchy one, like really. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, we gotta cut behind this? No. Nope. That's a line. What the fuck? What do you mean a line? This line? Or oh, oh, this this one? This line. Ooh. The line I just drew. Wait, how did you come up with that line though? Like quarter inch. Oh, from that? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, that's not ruin it, so I don't want to buy this again. <laughs> do they want to that if we mess up? <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, boy. All right, let's go. Let's <laughs> cut them up. Itchy, yeah. right? That's why I was worried about that. That's sketch. Why don't you start with grinding wheel, maybe? Make a little bit. <laughs> That's fucking sketchy. Oh, my God. Safety gas, baby. You really want me to do this? CPE, all right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, is it dead? No, I charged it last night. Oh man, that's so sketchy. Unlock maybe. 
<laughs> Hold that thing down, huh? Halfway <laughs> through. Halfway there. Very sketchy, though. Scary, dude. Fuck him, man. Fuck him, man. Fuck him. <laughs> so good so we don't what need a line right now. Why Hold are you fucking it. rocking it? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> is it quarter inch? We just guess it, right? <laughs> this guy ready to jump my transmission now. Sucks, Yuki. <laughs> You're definitely gonna have to shave the tranny more. What do they say you need that for? I think it's fucking useless. <laughs> Need to be deeper, right? This year? Mm -hmm. the these two ridges are the last ones. No, mm -hmm. in there, so there's one, two, three. So we like we're taking this off, like this part. We're yeah. not using it. Mm -hmm. We get to place. Mm -hmm. Oh, good. Yeah, I think that thing bolts up. Get out, get oh out. my god! Hey, that thousand dollar PC you buying for? Be nice with that. Oh my god, I can't believe we just cut that. <laughs> oh, that is so scary. Wow. Brand new. We just cut that goddamn transmission housing. It's the wrong train. Oh my god. Well, hopefully it still works. I'll get a bucket. So we cut too much, so we gotta go get a new transmission, right? Yeah. You gotta go buy it for me, Will? Yeah. <laughs> buy it snap on money like you. <laughs> How much are we cutting off that? Three eighths. That's sketchy too. We gotta cut that too? Mark, Mark oh. can cut three eighths 
inch up from input shaft, chamfer end of shaft similar to the OEM. And that three eighths. There we go. We got the We're trusting on this uh measure tape right here. We good? You gonna yeah. snap on one? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, you can do it, I was load it. Alright, so we marked it. Um We got ahead of ourselves. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's not have a metal in there. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna have metal in there already, you see the way you're driving? Yeah, okay. It'll look like Will's motor. <laughs> yeah. Man. Hey, my car doesn't break so far, so. And neither does mine. All right. Let's kind of keep it that way. We don't break down. Safety guys, safety guys. There you go. You can break it on the side. It's a hot piece right there. Just, just like that. Cut it down. Yeah, bevel. Do you have a file? Nope. I don't have a grinder either. It's good. Looks like professional. <laughs> we Wait, why we don't? Why don't we just use that? The shorter. Oh, to fit it. Oh. Hold on, I gotta turn it. Take this bolt out. Perfect. Does it look like ready to make 800 horsepower? I think so. <laughs> it's ready. Yeah, sure. You look pretty good though. For someone that don't know what he's right, doing. It'll be uh, five hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> What's next? Make sure there is no fluid left in the transmission. Remove the stock input shaft from front cover and gasket. Clean off or wear new gaskets will go. If you have an HR or VHR trans, you will need to put the adapter ring over the large bearing before installing the bell housing. Use new gasket and install bell housing. The socket head cap screws will go on the bottom side. The bottom four bolts will need seal on the threads. Torque bell housing bolts to 13 foot pounds. Is this a, this is not like a HR or VHR trans? I don't know, is it? Oh, boy. oh god. This is a CDO A, stop, whatever that means. Is that a CDO 9? Yeah. I don't fucking know. It is CDO 9. Is that, isn't that like an HR trans then? I don't know shit. Is, isn't that HR is, I don't know. HR is CDO 9, I think. Yeah, it is. So then you need, uh, you need to put the adapter ring sold separately. Nice, so I don't have it. What the fuck? What's the adapter ring? Hold on. So it doesn't show pictures really. Yeah, nice. those are nice pictures. Yeah, what the fuck is this? <laughs> $1,700 for a chair that they can't print the fucking <laughs> paper chair? Right, you can't even see it. This might be the way. No. We don't have no leak on my car. Hey, mine, mine doesn't leak either. Yeah, right? only his car leaks, right? And the, only the power steering and engine and everything leaks. It only leaks when something disastrous happens. So every day. <laughs> every day it leaks. When it's a normal functioning form, doesn't nothing happens. It's a brand normal. new gasket. That looks, that looks like a better than the stock one, no? Because stock one looks like a lava. The one that we just cut off or This is stock. Is it? Oh, never mind. Looks a little oily, guy. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up. Wipe them out. We need some brake clean. Lick it up. Do we use the bolts they gave us? Oh, fuck. Nope. You got brake clean, probably not. No. It doesn't. The bag's not labeled. Nice. The side needs. So we got a new gasket. I'm gonna put that thing on there now. Come on. Oh, nice. <laughs> Tell how many holes are in that. I think we did a pretty good job cutting. 
Yeah, it fits perfect. <laughs> oh my god. Almost like we do this every day. Is it different? What is it? you need thread lock on some of them. Hopefully we don't need RTV on this thing. I think it said some of the RTV in the instructions. Is it? I have some. Oh, because I don't. <laughs> Hopefully this thing doesn't leak because I don't want to be... That would be like pain in the ass to change. Yeah, this this is no real car. It doesn't leak. It's alright. <laughs> My car don't leak, alright? I'm gonna put a bolt in the bottom. Just wanna get it started. Are they all the same bolts, guys? The bottom two are different. Do you have the bottom two? Yeah, they're over there. We don't put the RTV first? We just Not on these ones on the bottom no, no, no. We put it after. How? <laughs> finger paint. <laughs> this guy. The housing is such nice though. It is. Yeah, put you outside good. Like yeah, because I can't be using SR trans. I'm going to blow that thing up in one lap. Do you know how to use that thing, guys? Too, uh, too advanced for you? Walk <laughs> around and find out. I want to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Remember oh, him what? twerking his head studs? Yeah, let's see, let's see how he can do it this time. Hey, it's 13 pounds? Yeah. This guy's going to go over the board. We're going to do the cross pattern. Get the, the iron. Yuki, this leak, you know why. Yeah, Will torqued it. You better, better not leak. <laughs> I'll, I'll make you fucking do it again. <laughs> Jump the chance off. Oh boy. That's not right. Is it? Yeah, that feels like more than 13. Look at this. I got it. It's fucking got it. 13 pounds is like What's a bubble saying? cover. It's saying 11. So go to 13. 13, 7. That's not 13. <laughs> well, this thing's moving. Alright, better not leak, Will. Counting on you. This guy getting trained on my car. Oh boy. Yeah, you gotta mark on the dead, alright? Don't forget. Where's the shot? In my pocket? No. Oh god! <laughs> so I did. Oh, fuck. <laughs> like a pain in the ass. Alright, we're all done. Hopefully it doesn't We don't got the one on top. Buddy. Oh, oh, boy. Fuck. This guy. <laughs> about to, is that sorry, <laughs> yeah, about to... Yeah, right. About to send my stuff like that. Alright, check everything again. Oh no 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 no! <laughs> it's fine. Ooh, this guy is catch. I don't like the gap, but fuck it. <laughs> I know. Sheesh, look good. Just need an engine. So we have a big problem. So what what kind of problem we have? Where can we put the shift board? Yeah, <laughs> so this thing uh, missing a big hole for the slave. 
Like, we just realized it after we put it on. Right. Just call them and they're like, oh, that's interesting. They said, and I'm like, wow, well, okay. So I don't know if, the, if it happened all the time or what, but you're missing that part right there. So I guess I gotta send that back and <laughs> wait for them to come in. At least this drive shaft looks good. Hopefully it's the right size, I hope. <laughs> Find out in next year. What is that? This thing? Mm hmm. Yikes. There you go. Just like that. Nice. Alright. Now we cut this or something? I will save that one for in case we need it. You gonna buy a new one? Fair enough. Cutting the shifter down. Oh boy. <laughs> Oh. Just cut on the end, is that what they want? What are you cutting? Basically you just wanna cut this rod out. Oh, the whole thing? Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, because it's too long, right? Obviously. Yeah. That middle line trash and then just weld that two piece together. Jeez, that's be hot. Super trash too. Let's weld that thing together. So we're gonna weld this thing now. Give it a shot. Alright. Hopefully it works out good. so many today huh mm -hmm. so why do you think we gotta cut this that's it tells us too but why don't you think i think it's because it hits maybe oh, the, it has to be top. right because like maybe you think we have to bang the transmission tunnel definitely oh man i hope not <laughs> i don't want to how do you use this it just like spin i think not spinning I think we're just gonna use this. Grinder. Yeah. Probably easier too. <laughs> Alright, we cut this thing pretty fresh now. So that's what they want us to do. I'm mm, gonna work on this next. All dying, we end up taking that off. <laughs> there you go. Put that thing back. Mm, custom made. <laughs> it works, hopefully. It should work. It will. It's like that. Now we put this on. Does it line up? Mm -hmm. Nice. I mean, we cut the thing to the bottom, so it's better. Right. That spring looks strong. <laughs> weak. Oh, yeah, it's weak. Never mind. It looks strong, you know. 10 psi. <laughs> Oh wow, pretty dope. Why is that sleeve for? The shifter down bottom. Oh. oh, okay, to connect that there. Mm -hmm. Put all the bolts on. That's for the mount, right? Yeah, so. this one. Mm. 
another guy goes in there in between but the boat doesn't even look that long is it it's pretty long yeah so i guess that go in the middle or on top might be in the middle it tells you on the book probably <laughs> i didn't see it in no there. i think that's just for cutting the bell yeah that, that has to be in the middle because yeah i think Oh no. Oh yeah, it does, right? Go cool, down? No, because no, it fits better in there. Oh. Is that go on the bottom? No. This is like cut out for that. Yeah. So it goes on top of it? But we'll find out. <laughs> yeah, it looks that look right. And then you got some prey. Oh, because of this bowl. Oh, yeah. Why do you want to ever move that bolt stuff? What's this bolt? Oh, this is the reverse lockout. This piece. Oh. So what does it do? Locks it so you can't come into reverse. Or you can. Wait, I want to go in. Wait, what do you mean? Like, you can't drive the boys? No, there's a way. I forgot how these get into reverse. Push down and the six, I thought. Wait, yeah. Push down and six. I think. Yeah, it's push down and number six usually. Mm -hmm. The Toyota is the top one, right? Or BMW. So you probably want to adjust the other way, maybe? So you have more room? That's reverse, right? Yeah, I think. I can't remember. It should be. It should be on the bo bottom where the six is. All right, we worry about that later. It works. That's it works. Fun. It works. Without the car, so. let's see if he works with on the car. <laughs> well, the piece we made works. Yeah, that's the important part. So, does this thing supposed to face that way or in the like? Definitely this way because it's like cut out on this purple piece. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I right. just don't know how you adjust that. All right. Well, hopefully, it's easy. <laughs> All right. So this transmission can stay here until the engine is ready so and once the engine is ready you can put that thing on the s15 now you want to say something no. no what are we doing on this just setting up a new dash i got <laughs> okay <laughs> all right well kind of hype on that hopefully we get to see that soon so beside the fact that they sent us the wrong parts everything else went good for like so we gotta cut all the stuff and nothing crazy went bad so that's pretty good i'm pretty excited i was excited to something goes wrong at all but at least it went wrong because they sent the wrong parts but it looks like they are sending the right parts in a couple days we're gonna get that but we're just gonna mount it basically what we just did you know same thing take it off put it back so it shouldn't be too bad uh, i can't wait for the engine and Hopefully we get to uh, keep you guys posted with new engines soon. And then hopefully we get to hear the engine run by end of the year. Maybe that'll be nice. But if not, at least until next season, there's no rush, you know. So, yeah, stay tuned. And thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and leave us a comment if you like. Thank you.